Welcome back to our coverage here at the Fall Casual Market in Atlanta. We are here with Eric Damer from Merrick Designs. We're going to take a little bit of a different path with this interview. We're going to talk about the outdoor furnishings category, which I think um, is a lot of fun because it gives consumers something to buy every time they come into a store. Welcome, That's Eric. right. Thank you, Cindy. Thanks for having me. We're excited to, excited to chat with you. So, you know, we're asking everyone we're talking with, you know, first of all, what are you hearing business-wise? You know, what are, what are your dealers coming in? What are they saying? What are they looking for? Economy's kind of challenging right now, but our retailers are doing really well, actually. They're, um, the outdoor market um, is just continuing to grow and expand as it has been the last 10 years as more and more people entertain outdoors. And so, um, you know, our retailers are optimistic and, um, you know, they're doing okay. They're hanging in there. And, you know, I think to your point, you know, it's interesting. We have seen this boon in all things outdoors. And, you know, we were just talking and, you know, you really have to feel like that's that probably will continue to grow. But what I love about your line is that you give people options that are, uh, you can change seasonally or you can change every so often. So tell folks a little bit about like your line, the best sellers, what's hot right now? Well, it's melamine and acrylic tableware. And um, it's great for outdoor entertaining because you don't have to worry about breakage. And it looks like glass and ceramic. So it's very versatile. And so versatile that people are also using it indoor year round because it looks so nice. It's really elevated, it's luxury looking. And every year we come out with new designs and for our retailers, it's about keeping it fresh. Every year they want to see new designs and freshness so they can dress their tables up with. It's all about dressing the table up and creating a tablescape that brings joy and happiness and some fun to the table. And, and so what are some of the top looks right now? Because I know, I guess, last market, you guys introduced um, a set that looked like wood, which was yeah, incredible. Yeah. yeah. So talk just a little bit about some of the specific patterns, colors, whatever that you see. People really want organic, um, kind of natural feeling design. So like the Sequoia wood, which you mentioned, has been one of the best sellers. In fact, we got asked to add serving pieces to the line. So we have like nice. five new serving pieces. We have a white marble design that is a matte finish that um, really looks like marble, but is, you know, it's safe, it's break resistant, it's lightweight. And then now we have a new reactive glaze. It's kind of after this Japanese pottery look, the reactive glaze that we're previewing here at the show that's already getting a really good reaction. So it's just about um, making it look like it's ceramic or glass or wood, marble, but without the safety worry or the heaviness that you do with the real product. Right, right. And, you know, you were saying that so far in market, you guys have been, you've actually had people coming yeah, up and we pretty, have. pretty good traffic so far. Usually there. the first days are, um, you know, a little slower in the beginning, but we've had a steady flow of traffic this morning, which is really promising and exciting. Nice. And uh, we've been doing the show for um, 15 years. So we have a really good following in this industry and, a lot of friends, a lot of retailers have become our friends over the years. So, um, and the first thing they ask is what's new? So uh, just keeping it fresh is what we're all about. As long as we do that, we'll continue to have success. Well, and I think it speaks again, you know, we were chatting and I, this love of outdoor, I think is here to stay. I think most people feel that way. Where do you see opportunities moving ahead? You know, what's, what's left to discover, uncover, put out there? You know, I just think it's about being creative with your outdoor, um, your outdoor room, your outdoor environment, because it's it's just continue to going to continue to grow. Uh, for example, this summer we had five outdoor parties at our house, and uh, gosh, all our friends really look forward to it. They bring a potluck, salads, they each bring their own dish. We have one friend that every time she comes, she brings us a big watermelon. You know, <laughs> and it's like. How do I cut this watermelon? <laughs> Can you bring it cut, you know? And like at the end of a busy week, everyone just is looking forward to gathering and, you know, having fun and being in an outdoor environment in the summer. So, and dressing up your room and, and um, just making it look elegant and sophisticated and uh, part of your house, you know, really. So. To extend the indoors outside, as we always say. Wonderful. Well, Eric, thank you so much for joining thank us you, Cindy. today. 
Make Thank sure you, you go up and check out what's new at Merritt Designs and ask Eric to show you the latest and the greatest and get your outdoor space ready for the next get together.